Hey guys, what's up? It's Kay Jones here, and this video is going to be on my two-year Iron Woman progression. Uh, I'm going to be showing you my pets, I'm going to be showing you my boss KC, my skilling levels, and my bank. Okay guys, so the first thing I want to show y'all is my pets and also my boss log before we get to the bank. I've got, of course, a Wily Hellcat, a Rock Golem, so I got the mining pet. I think I got that 84 mining. I have the Prince Black Dragon uh, pet, which is my favorite that I have. And I think that was at 530-ish KC on K uh, KBD. And then I have a Hell Puppy. So those are my, uh, basically, I four pets. Uh, I also have a pet rock. There it is. Okay. So, but my three pets from skilling or from bossing are those three. KBD is by far my favorite though. Okay. So this is my boss log. I have about almost 400 KC on Criara. Unfortunately, I haven't gotten all the pieces for that and I'll explain that later. Commander Zillion, 109 KC. General Garador, which is Bandos, 113. Uh, 140 on, um... Zami, we got Dagonoth Rex, Prime Supreme, which I plan to do more of. Giant Mole, I have only have one KC for the Diary. Catafite Queen, a little bit over 100. Venonatus, uh, uh, 136. King Black Dragon, 537. A crazy Archaeologist, I had to do 88 in order to get my Ruined Crossbows. Uh, Zora, 844. Barrow's Chest, 500. I haven't done any more past that. Jad, 14 KC. I probably would have higher, but I skipped some of those tasks. Kraken, 1,200 and something. Uh, the Thermonuclear Smoke Devil, not too many of those. Cerberus, I finished that in about almost 400 kills. Abyssal Sire, I finished that for Bludgeon, 561. Skitizos, 29. Winter Tot, 619. That was to get 99 fire making. 452 Raid KC for Raids 1. I haven't started Raids 2. 164 Vorkath KC. So those are pretty much the primary ones. Alright guys, and here is a quick look at my stats. I think the primary ones would be my 99s, which is 99 range, magic, um, fire making, uh, and I think, oh, hit points of course. And then I'm getting really close on max combat. Uh, I'm actually, this is kind of funny, I'm 6k away from 95 uh, crafting, so you can kind of just count that one as a 95. I don't know, I'm just so close, I just haven't gotten it. Um, I also have 99 thieving, but trying to go for 90 plus, but I'm in no rush, and I do plan to eventually max. I have all the quests completed, of course, I have my quest cape, so those are all done. Uh, and here, I finally finished all of the favor for Zaya. Uh, it took two years to do that though, because I think only about a month ago did I finish the Lova Kinge favor. I kind of procrastinated on that one. Alright guys, and here's for the part you've all been waiting for, my bank. Two year Iron Woman progression video, and here's the bank. Okay, so we're going to be starting with kind of the junk items first. It's like all those questing items that nobody really needs, or like holiday items, gree grees clue items. They're kind of just stuffed in this tab. You know, I've got my pyromancer. Things that I need, but that I don't need. Especially, you know, getting all my clue stuff together. This is going to be my farming tab. It's worth, like, almost a total of 10 mil, which is kind of crazy. I just got a bunch of seeds in here. I should mean farming. I think I have probably 93, 92 banked. I'm not too sure. I have a ton of seeds. And I'm working to get that farmer's outfit and everything like that. Sorry, my cat wanted to say hi. <laughs> Hello. Uh, but yeah, that's my, and I've got all my farming tools and cactus spines and things like that in this tab. Uh, the next tab is going to be kind of like a slayer tab. Um, and sold heads, fossils, and hides. Okay, cat. Okay. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, we got like, when I do Vorkath, I just tend to stick the hides in here. I don't really know why. I don't know where else to put them besides perhaps my crafting tab. Crystal keys are in here, insold heads, things like that, basically. Um, 
five KBD heads, so that's a lot. I've got an extra Calphite Queen head. I've got another one in the bank. Two Dark Claws. And next we have, oh, and of course all those insult heads. Next, this is kind of like my tool tab. There's not really much in it, but everyone needs to kind of have a tool tab because you got buckets, ropes, hammers, all that good stuff. Here is my range tab. Now for range, it's kind of a mess. All of my good range gear is in the tabs later. But uh, things like an extra Bandos hide boots, um, that is, I have one in my bank and then just one in my house because I don't want to get rid of it. You know, my cannon, things like that. This tab can actually, is actually kind of messy, but I don't want to get rid of anything that I have here. Like these onyx bolt tips and these dragon stones and then... You know, there's a couple things I could get rid of. We have some ballista limbs, things like that. A bunch of dragon darts. It's about, it doesn't look like much, but it's worth about 23 mil. Uh, a lot of dragon arrows and dragon bolts, etc. Okay, this tab is my mage tab, my runes tab, uh, my staffs. Mm, got a little bit of rune crafting in there with the talismans. I've got my rune pouch and just a ton of teleports. I haven't got that master scroll book yet. And that's about it. Uh, some cool stuff in here is the dust battle stabs, the mud battle stabs, and the mist battle stabs. I have a ton of pure essence. People ask me where I get my pure essence from as an iron woman or an iron man. Uh, basically, those are mostly from raids and Zora. Before that, you did it from temple trekking or mining them or from banshees. Next, we have my herb tab. Excuse me, my nose is running. We have my herb tab, and basically we have you know, um, my food that I haven't cooked, uh, herbs. I have all my unfinished potions or like, you know, just little doses of potions at the bottom, but I've got a lot of jug of wines, uh, cooking and food and herbler tab. Uh, got a lot of super attacks. I do need to make a lot of this stuff. Like for example, I need to make Gosh, I've got like 250 unfinished Raynar or Renar potions and a ton of unfinished quorms and irits and things like that. And basically, I just stack them up 12k raw monkfish that I need to cook eventually, 5k cooked, things like that. Um, kind of low on combat potions, serotonin and bruise, etc. But this entire tab is worth rough, roughly almost 69 mil, which is crazy. A lot of that's just from the potions. Okay, so for this tab, it looks really pretty. It's my crafting and skilling tab, kind of. Uh, I've got a ton of ore that I need to do. Basically, uh, that's a couple smithing levels right there with everything that we've got in here. Um, so I basically will have to get back on that and get a couple levels from that. Seaweeds and buckets of sand for crafting. <laughs> I'm allergic to my cat, so I'm like dying. She's in my lap. <laughs> Um, oak planks. I haven't, like, 10k teak logs. I plan to go for 99 construction eventually, but I'm kind of just getting the teaks over time through miscellanea. I chopped all these U logs, uh, getting 90 woodcut, and now I'm at 93. Um, redwood logs, I've been cutting those, um, basically AFK while I do schoolwork, but, uh, I've got a couple stuff in here for construction, but I plan to kind of knock out 99 construction mostly all at once. I've got that D-Pick, 50 ruined pickaxes, a ton of gems. People ask me where these gems come from. Raids, uh, bossing, things like that. They just add up over time. 258 ruined axes. I like to stash up on the ruined axes because it took me forever to get my first ruined axe, so I definitely now want to have like all the rune axes in the game because it took me months in the beginning just to get my first rune axe uh -huh. and then we've got dragon axe infernal axe and some unpowered orbs when i need that i have a black axe because you need it for an easy clue i just haven't had the chance to make the hidey hole 38 glories um just a lot of stuff like that sapphire rings to make recoils and etc tons of flax i don't really like the infernal axe so with my second axe i just put it separate and then here the next tab is the big one guys this is the one that everyone wants to see oh yeah this is like all the gear and stuff like that it's for people who are asking why i have so many like rune plate bodies and like full helms almost 400 full helms it's because i'm a hoarder 
Iron Man, the great thing about that, especially as a regular Iron Man, not ultimate or anything, is you can hoard things. 24 granite balls, tons of daggers, but there are different types of P++. Pluses, um, dragon skirt, dragon plate legs, uh, dragon sword. I got a ton of boots, a ton of shield left halves, a couple obby capes from when I was a noob and I did at the Tarzar. Those anti-dragon shields. I put a couple of capes in here that I don't have the full set for because it looks nice. And I just like to collect things. I probably will alk the granite shield at some point and also these rock shell plate bodies. But I've got the bank space for now. Um, five leaf bladed axe, battle axes, which are pretty rare. Six leaf bladed swords. A ton of dragon mitt helms. My slayer helmet. That is probably one of my favorite items that I have. I love the red slayer helmet. Uh, Dragon Warhammer, that's a big one. My Abyssal Bludgeon is another really big one. Six Abyssal Whips, one Abyssal Tentacle, and you start coming down with the helmets. We have the Serpentine Helmet that I rarely ever use. Uh, Helm of Netsinot, I believe it's called. We've got four Berserker Rings. I got really lucky on those. Two Warrior Rings, two Seer's Rings, uh, Imbued Archer Ring, and then two Extra Archer Rings. Two Kraken Tentacles, I'm trying to get to ten. My Tridents, I've got two Uncharged and one Trident of the Swamp. I had another Magic Fang, but I used it for scales, so I got a couple of duplicates out of that. Two Bandos Chest Plates, Bandos Tacits. I've got two Complete God Swords, which is Bandos and Sarah Doman. Two of the Armadil Hilts. Unfortunately, I have like 400 Armadil KC, and I only have two Hilts, which is really bizarre because... All the other items beside the hilts are like 1 in 128 drop rate, and the hilts are like 1 in 512. So it honestly makes no sense. I don't get it, but RNG for y'all. My occult, ang ang puh, occult necklace, anguish, ring of suffering, just kind of a uh, dragon bone necklace. I got that from Vorkath. Um, my, unfortunately, my Picasian boots are kind of way over here, and then my Eternals and Primordials are over here. Kind of not together there but we've got full arams uh almost full carols except the coif uh full derricks uh missing the flail on the varics but i'm not too concerned about that and then missing the helm for guthans and then we've missing torags but i just kind of put that together there three god sword shard twos i use the other ones up here on my god swords ancestral top i think that's a really big one um definitely i have more fire capes but i gambled all of them imbued zamorak cloak Another big one is the Kodai Wand. So the Kodai Wand and the Ancestral Top are two really big ones in this, task, uh, this tab. And then I've got the Dragon Fire Shield and then an extra Visage. I got pretty lucky. Um, it's funny, I played RuneScape since I was like nine years old and I never got a Dragon Visi. And then I got two in my Iron Man and I was like, okay, I'll take it. Two Dark Bows and then we got that Armadil Crossbow. So nice. Blowpipe, of course, and an extra Picasian Crystal. And the assembler. This is definitely everyone's favorite tab. Uh, and then finally with the last tab, it's just kind of miscellaneous stuff like my coins. I only have 5 mil right now, but most of my money is in alkables here. For example, this ta this stack of air battle staff is, is worth 5.3 mil. And these undone battle stabs that I haven't crafted into is about 3 mil. So you almost have 10 mil sitting right there. Uh, Zora skills, I'm super low. I need to go do those. Marks of Grace. Uh, things like that, Tokyo, Dark Totems, my Skill Capes, a Void, uh, Elite Void, and then we've got, you know, my Armor from the Diaries, and my Graceful, Hard Clues, miscellaneous stuff that's important to have on your Iron Man account. So the entire bank value is 979 mil. I'm so close to a bill, guys. I tried to get a bill uh, bank, um, you know, value. But today is the exact day that my account turned two years old, and I wanted to show y'all what your Iron Man can look at look like at two year progression. Uh, so I definitely turned uh, Sarthon, which is the name of my account, turned two years today, and it shows you the amount of amazing progression I made on my Iron Man. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really wanted to get an armadillo chest plate or chain skirt. I just didn't get lucky, unfortunately. Uh, I wasn't able to get that within two years. But on my next video, I plan to have that. My next video will be my three-year progression video. So a whole year from now. But I plan to max on my Iron Man, and I'm excited. Thank you so much for watching, guys. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And please feel free to subscribe to my channel for more videos. 
And I hope you guys enjoyed this. And you're welcome to follow me on Twitter and Twitch. Because I stream every once in a while on Twitch. And thanks for watching guys. And I hope you all have a good night.